Hi, it's Erin Klein from Kleinspiration. I want to give you a quick tutorial of the features that Class Dojo has to offer. When you sign up for a free account, you will be asked to enter your email address and your password. So I'll do that quickly and show you what I've set up for mine. And once you're in, I'm Mrs. Klein, not Mr. We'll have to get that fixed. But you can do a quick little two minute tutorial to kind of see some of the features. I'll just show you the demo class. This is um, something already set up that you can refer to. You can use this, the in-class view, on your whiteboard, your projector, or a laptop in your classroom so that the kids can view it as you're adding points. And this is just a page that they've set up for you. So say, for example, we want to give Halle Berry a point for hard work. You'll see down here it pops right up, one point. And it's a visual right here so that she knows. Say that we want to give Johnny Depp. Um, a negative point, which I'm not big on giving negative points, but say he forgot his homework, if that's something you're interested in doing. Um, no thanks for setting up the smartphone right now, but we can do that later. Say that you want to give Angelina Jolie a good point for helping others. You can see that it adds hers right there. You can also select to show only the positives or to show only the negatives. Um, I kind of like showing only the positives. I can end the tutorial in the class right here. The report cards feature will show all of your data. It automatically does it for you. And you can select it by the week, by the day. You can email it to parents, to administrators. You can download the PDF as well. But it saves it all for you. And you can see it's all with just one click. I want to show you quickly how to add a class so that you can see how simple it is. We'll just say you want to do uh, seventh grade and you want to do math. You can click Done creating your class. Quickly you can enter your students names. We'll just do Riley. You can add last names if you wish. There's her little avatar. We'll add one for Jacob. And you can add a student. And when you're done, go to behaviors after you've entered your kids. It gives you suggestions or you can create your own. So in math if you kinda wanna back it up and if you're doing um, something in math that covers area can do that. Um, maybe you don't want to do helping others, you want to do something else math related. Um, you can add one of the content points here, maybe for being on task. Creativity, maybe you want to keep that. Great work, maybe you want to keep that. For hard work, maybe you want to add something um, like perimeter. And um, you can just go to finished right over here. And it does automatically save it for you in case you forget to push. Your data is not going to be lost. So we can go to the 7th grade math class that we just started. And you'll see um, Jacob and Riley will pop up right here. So during math class, if I have this minimized and I'm teaching my lesson, you know, my PowerPoint, my smart board lesson or whatever, I can have that up on the screen. And when I'm ready, I can just pop up my active engagement page through Class Dojo. Click on Jacob. Wow, that was really great. Um, you definitely noticed area. Nice job. So you can give him a point for that. Say that during the lesson, Riley added great insight. You can give her a point for that. So it's real-time data for um, content-related items or for um, behavior as well. And it saves it all for you. You can print it off, email it, bring it to meetings with you. I'll let parents know um, daily how their children are doing. If you've got kids on behavior plans, you can just print this off and send it right home with them instead of writing information out on a sheet of paper or filling things out or emailing. It does it all for you. It's super easy. It's kind of magical, I think. I love it. I hope that you love it. Um, sign up for a free account today and just try it out. I think you'll be amazed with how easy it is and how useful it can be for you. I think that you'll really enjoy it. Thanks for watching.